it's Ezekiel from Mavic Seeger YouTube channel and today I will talk about trading during the summer. So right now you're watching euro dollar chart and I put every true range indicator on this chart the MetaTrader 4 platform. As you can see this is something that I see very often in July and August and some some low liquidity months as that we can see believe it or not 47 pips daily average shoe range for euro dollar below 50 is british pound dollar too so this is the incredibly crazy 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 low average true range period so how you should trade during this in this way so first i'm just watch euro dollar chart for example and as you can see on the hourly chart from july 18 till july 23 we had a range so tight range from 1.087 to 1.09 so believe or not this is the you know whole week or seven days 30 pips only 30 pips range so if you are intraday trader you can have problem in trading because it's very hard to touch the targets so my strategy during this time is to put wider stop loss and target and to weigh the market do something so what i'm usually do i put support and resistance and i'm trying of course to see the overall trend for example for euro dollar the overall trend is bearish in last you know couple weeks and because of that so actually it's not a couple weeks it's a uh, more uh, 10 days so we have some kind of a bearish move right now someone will tell this is the um consolidation or this is the short time reversal or something like that but when i see you know a couple days of the bearish and your intraday trader you see the current week for example the weekly chart is bearish i like to be and say that i'm bearish a relative strength index you clearly bearish i like to draw trend lines from relative strength index and you can see it's a bearish so i was bearish i put a sell order i tried for example to pick the the high i think that i was something here in the middle about 1.085 something like that put a wider stop loss you know 5 10 pips above the resistance or support and then you just try to reach some higher target so in this time during the summer usually intraday traders can really become the swing traders because you need to hold your positions sometimes couple days because the market cannot reach the targets and a lot of traders trying this time to you know range trading scalping or something like that but usually this can be very very difficult because of low volume uh fall spikes and this can brings you a, a lot of problems for example british pound dollar is a real example look this so today we had a range the range was broken 15 pips below and then price again move into the range so what i'm doing i'm just uh, draw the resistance trend line i just draw the trend line and i put my stop loss to be wide above this trend line because there's a lot of false breakouts so in my analysis i'm bearish below 1.2940 so i'm bearish and i'm looking sometimes to find to sell sometimes i do not reach enough high make mistakes uh, I, you, you, it's very hard to be to be precise in these moments so what i do no problem make a sell trade make wider stop loss and wait so my personal strategy this is not recommendation this is my way how i see the market during the summer during the low volatility during the low liquidity during these days what i'm doing i try to reduce number of trades sometimes i have only one trade whole day i do not trade Trade. I just make one trade, make one stop loss, make a target and wait. For example, for British pound dollar, my stop loss is 1.2940. And what I not want to reach is very strong, very, very strong level. And that level is 
to 850 this is the mile level very very strong level in trading you can see this level was resistance many many times if you go for example last 10 years you will see this level was very very strong i believe in this in this in this support so i want to see the price touch this level maybe a few pips above or something like that but this is my level i made sell order i have a good risk reward ratio and i just wait so i avoid to do range trading i avoid during the summer to play with false breakouts i just put one trade wider stop loss and wait so tell me what you think about my strategy there is a comment there are comments below write your comments what your opinions i wish you a great day and bye bye